Morning, happy Thursday, September 16th. So I am in Caitlin's car. We just went over and had our hair cut, so I got a nice fresh trim on it, so it feels good. And then she kind of straightened it, so yeah, it feels good. So um, yeah, I have the day off today. So I'm just gonna hang out. I took, I we had a nine o'clock appointment. It's now 1030, <laughs> it took us forever. They curled Caitlin's hair. She's a really nice hairdresser, we really like her. And uh, so, she, yeah, she curled Caitlin's hair, so it took us forever. It took us an hour and a half. And most of that was Caitlin's haircut, so, but um, yeah, it was fun. We, Caitlin and I always go together to get our hair cut. It's always fun. So, she stopped at the bank, so I figured I would say hello. And um, yeah, I recorded what I ate for breakfast this morning. I was so hungry this morning. And after I ate my oatmeal, I was still so hungry. Although the last time I felt like that, I ate an apple and then I felt better. So maybe I should have done that. I didn't think of that. But anyway, probably when I get home, maybe I'll have an apple. But yeah. All right. Well, Caitlin's coming out, so I will talk to you later. Here is breakfast. I have a half a cup of oats for two points. One small banana mashed up for one point. A half a tablespoon of peanut butter for one point. I have an iced coffee with two tablespoons of caramel macchiato creamer for two points and four tablespoons of half and half for two points and I'm drinking water. I'm really, really hungry, so I'm gonna have an apple for one point. Hey, it is almost time for dinner, so I thought I would just come out and say hello. I am so hungry. I All I've done is think about food all day. I've tried to, you know, redirect my thoughts. I just ate an apple. So, hopefully that will help. I'm going to be making dinner soon, so I think I'm going to make um, chicken parm. I think I'm going to bread the chicken with uh, shake and bake. Try to make chicken parm that way with some spaghetti, so that should be good. But um, it's been a nice relaxing day. I got some videos uh, edited that I haven't been able to edit. So I got that done. I was going to do some more laundry, but I never did that. So when I go back in, I need to throw in a little laundry and then start dinner. But um, yeah, I just wanted to say hello. And today's Thursday, so today is weigh-in. So I wanted to tell you about my weigh-in. So um, this is... This is the best that I've felt in so long. I can't even tell you, probably over a year. This is the best I've felt. I feel so, I feel like my head is clear. So, um, feels really good. So I woke up this morning, start. I, I was so hungry even when I woke up this morning. But, um, yeah, I got on the scale and I lost... 2.6 this week. I, I was so shocked. I was so shocked. This is the lowest. I looked at my, um, my tracker and this is the lowest I've been since the 1st of April. So that felt really good. Um, so I've lost officially, I've lost 9.8 pounds of the 35 that I've gained. That feels really good. I'm fitting better in my clothes back and getting back to where I was and that feels really good and just having a clear mind and just feeling good and not I mean gosh the depression was so bad and I I, I the medicine's working or I'm just feeling better I don't know what it is but I I'm just feeling so much better and I'm feeling like myself. So, like I was in June of 2020. I 
I feel, I can't even express how much better I feel. So I couldn't, I just, I was so excited with my loss this morning and it just feels really good. I, uh, like I said, I tried to stay on plan best I could today, but just being so hungry, I just, I don't know. I don't know what it was. So I had the oatmeal this morning and I had the iced coffee. I ate my oatmeal and it was like I hadn't even eaten. I like I my stomach just felt like I hadn't even eaten. So but I just went to get our hair cut and and then um the iced coffee, the Dunkin the small Dunkin' Donuts iced coffee that I showed you, uh we stopped at Dunkin' Donuts on the way home and Caitlin had ordered her coffee wrong that she had ordered. And so I said, Caitlin, I'll just buy you another one. It's no big deal. So I went up to the counter and I said, I'm just going to order her a, a different coffee because she ordered it wrong. And he said, oh, what did she, what did she order? What did she, what did she want? And I said, oh, no, no, she ordered it wrong. So I'll just buy another one. And he said, no, I'll make her another one. What does she need? So that was awesome. So we still kept the first one and I came home and I put some of my Dunkin' Donuts creamer in it because she didn't order it with any of the liquid sugar or any cream. So, and that's not how she wanted it. But, um, so I came home and put some of the Dunkin' Donuts creamer in that coffee and it tasted better, but they both, then I, I walked away and I was doing other things and then the ice melted in both of them. So I didn't even finish them. So the little clip I showed you of uh, what was left of my coffee, that's all I drank. But I'm still just going to count four points for the first coffee. Um, and then that will cover both coffees, I figure. So, but I just, I don't know. I just got doing other things and forgot all about my coffee. Well, the one that I made this morning, I left it in the car this morning when we had our hair cut. And, and that had already started melting, so... I don't know, but anyway, I just got busy, but, or not even busy. I wasn't even busy. I don't know. Got, I got doing something else, but anyway, so, but I am going to go in and make dinner, do, throw a little laundry in. I've got to do that. I'm going to throw a little laundry in and then I'm going to start dinner and, uh, I'll show you that when that's done and I'll talk to you later. Okay. So while I was making dinner, I got so, so sick. I was so nauseous and I didn't feel well at all. So I ate uh, a whole, well, first I had a cup of orange juice. I'm gonna count as three points. And then I had a whole stack of townhouse crackers. I don't know how many points that is. I'll have to see if I can figure it out the best I can. I'm starting to feel better now, so I'm gonna have some spaghetti. I didn't even measure the spaghetti out. I'm gonna guess six points for the spaghetti. It's zero point marinara sauce, and then a point for the Parmesan cheese. Okay, so here's my food journal for the day. I put a little star up here because I wanna remind myself that I didn't fill this all out at those certain times. I started out in the morning and then, I don't know, 11, 11.30, I stopped and then I kind of filled this out at the end of the day so all right so at six I woke up very hungry at eight I was very hungry and ate my oatmeal and drank my iced coffee still feeling hungry went to my hair appointment after my hair appointment at 11 o'clock I had the two pieces of donut stick and then at 11 30 still feeling hungry and eating the nachos queso and salsa at three, been hungry all afternoon, ate an apple, then ate another apple. At five, wasn't feeling well, drank orange juice. At six, couldn't eat dinner, ate crackers. And then at 7.30, feeling better, eating spaghetti with marinara sauce and Parmesan cheese. So yeah, all right, let me show you my tracker. Okay, so here's my tracker for the day. If I hadn't gotten so sick and I didn't need to eat the crackers, I would have finished my day much better, but I finished my day at negative 16. So my weekly started over because it's weigh-in day today. So I have 19 weeklies left for the remainder of the week. I didn't get any activity in. I drank about a half a gallon of water. 
For breakfast, I had the oatmeal, peanut butter, banana, the iced coffee, and then I had the two pieces of the donut sticks. Then I had the nachos, queso, and salsa. And then I had an apple, and then I had another apple. And then I had the orange juice, the townhouse crackers, the spaghetti with marinara sauce, and Parmesan cheese. All right. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you tomorrow. Bye.